Hey guys, this is a mechanic task guide for saving the mole. This is a task for the new map Ground Zero where you do have to locate the USEC PMC group at the parking lot of the terror group complex. And then you have to locate the lab scientist. Then you have to access the scientist's office. And then finally, you have to locate and obtain the scientist's hard drive to be able to survive an extract with that hard drive to hand it over to mechanic. So here's a map of Ground Zero and where we do have to go is the northern part of the map inside of the actual terror group complex. And my PMC will be starting just in front of the terror group building. So here we are on the map and for the first part of this task we do want to head into the parking lot which is on the left side of the terror group complex so vaulting over these obstacles we will be heading towards the left side of this building and into the actual garage and as we do end up approaching this white van then you will end up getting a subtask complete since all of these dead bodies are the members of the USEC PMC group after this part then you do want to head down the hallway to the right until we do come to a big open room and then you want to head towards the big cat statue on the far side of the room we are going to end up going left from this cat statue and then we're going to go past daddy long neck here the dead fellow that's next to the couch you're going to follow this hallway all the way around until you do see the collapsed area and as you approach all this rubble then you will end up finding a body inside of it this is actually the scientist and when you do loot him then you will find the terror group science office key so this key is similar to the customs unknown key in that it is a 100 percent spawn rate quest key so unless somebody has already looted it then it will always be there for you and also, once you do loot this key, then you can place it in your secure container just in case you do end up dying before getting to use it. So once you have the key, then you want to head back out the same way that you came in, past the cat statue, and then keep to your left, and then take the staircase that is on the left-hand side there all the way up to the next floor. Once you get to the top of the stairs, then you do want to take the hallway into your right side before the desk, and then head towards the very bright screen as well as the big number three on the wall. But as you get closer to the number three, then you will actually see a door that is just to the right of it, which is going to be number four. And this is the room that will be unlocked by the science office key. Once you do unlock this door, then we will have to find the hard drive in here. So as far as I know, there are three potential spawn locations inside of this room. And all three of them are going to be at the desk to the middle left of the room. So it can be on the bottom right shelf, which is where mine ended up spawning for me. Or it can also be on top of the desk in the middle. Or it can also be on top of the desk to the left of the chair. And after you have obtained the hard drive, then you will have to survive an extract from the map to be able to be able to turn it over to mechanic. Although if you do happen to die in between finding the hard drive and extracting, then you will have to come back into this room to find the hard drive all over again, which does include finding that key once again. So hopefully you guys found this guide useful and did help you to complete this task on the new map. Thank you all for checking out my video on this task. I definitely appreciate it and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day. So what you're seeing on the screen right now is just a couple of my different social links in case you guys wanted to connect more easily. I am primarily streaming on Twitch now multiple nights a week. So if you do want to connect with me or my community, that would probably be the easiest way to do so. And if you do come over to the Twitch and you want to join the Discord community, then just type exclamation point Discord or cord in the chat in order to get an invite link. And if you don't use Twitch, then I do have a link in the picture as well as a link below in the description. And we are growing and currently have an active and welcoming community with people of all experience and skill levels. So there will always be someone who could help to answer any questions that you may have. As always, thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching the video, and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day.